The coronavirus isn't just attacking lives, it's crippling businesses too, most notably bars and restaurants. But as Brad Underwood shows us, a new restaurant is now open in Westwood, and it seems to be just what that neighborhood ordered. Ivory House will celebrate a month of business later this week. Westwood's newest neighbor takes familiar food favorites to a new level of fine dining. We've been received well from the community and um, it's showing every day. What you see today is 18 months in the making. The coronavirus pandemic nearly shut down work and has forced some changes. There are 40% less seats, masks are worn when you come in and temperatures are taken. There's curbside pickup and soon outdoor seating, both options not originally in the plans. We considered about not opening soon, but the the facility was ready, the restaurant was ready, and the community was asking for it. So we were like, let's open, let's, let's do this. The majority of the food is local. The restaurant is gluten-free and many dishes have a personal story behind them, something that makes executive chef Dana Adkins smile. There's a few dishes from my grandfather who recently passed, and seeing those inspiration come to life has been really special. Adkins says that personal touch will continue with future menus, giving others a chance to create. We want to offer our team something to be a part of that growth. Like we're already starting the conversation for fall menu. The restaurant is also personal for its owners, Frank Eversall and Rick Pouillat. They spent a decade rebuilding Westwood, one home and apartment at a time. Now, a brand new dining experience, paying tribute to Westwood with artwork throughout the restaurant. And even its name pays homage to Westwood's last mayor, James Gamble, inventor of ivory soap. Every, everything that he gave back to the community, uh, we thought it was only fitting to kind of tip our hat to, to Mr. Gamble and thank him for that. Right now, the menu offers lunch and dinner. Next week, brunch comes to the table. In Westwood, Brad Underwood, Local 12 News. Alex. And today is actually James Gamble's birthday. Soon, Ivory House won't be the only new kid on the block. Nation Kitchen and Bar is planning to open a second location in the old Westwood Firehouse this fall.